Welcome to Frozen Education, this is Ed. Today I'm going to be talking quickly about NIO, giving a quick updates on trend lines, where the current support's at, and just quick uh, overview in terms of the movements. My uh, longest term DD on it and a bit more detailed has been in the previous video. I'm going to make sure to mention it down in the description, as well as my Twitter on there. Now, quick... Uh, first things first, we're going to do the one month, one day, and then I'm going to go on to the one hour period, and I'm going to go through the trend lines quickly. So to, you can see the 10 SMA here is still above the 30 MA. Amazing news here. You get to see that the uh, William Percent R is though still trending at overbought situation, but it has been for quite a bit. You get to see the average directional index is sitting at a higher number, so you need to look into the one hour period. Volumes have dropped a little, but it's still seen a really massive increase. We're talking about still in hundreds of millions in terms of volume. You get to see that the MACD, even though it dipped back yesterday, it still is increasing. So that's a good sign of health. You see five days, one hour period here. Taking a quick look, you get to see that the movement that it's having right now, it looks like it might actually be a start of a movement. So 23 is a start of a movement. William percent R here is still showing overbought situation a little bit into the day. Uh, going in towards the MACD, you can get to see that there's actually a reversal that happened over the uh, somewhere around 2 p.m. where the MACD had just turned positive. That's amazing news as well for overnight holders. Looking into momentum, you get to see the stock has decent momentum for quite a bit. Um, nothing else to look at here except the current support. The current support is sitting at 13.22 and the current resistance is sitting at 14.89 um, with a bit of a chance going up. Uh, but I would say 14.94 or 14.89 seems like a good support. We're going to do quickly Fibonacci retracements. Actually, first of all, we're going to look into the trend lines. The trend line seems to have not been broken. Even with the dip that we saw yesterday, it still held really nicely. And I didn't have to really move the trend line at all for my last one. Uh, the trend line really marks it pretty well. And you get to see that from tomorrow, from 11.71, we're looking at right one... Okay, so you get to see probably this trend line in the morning will be somewhere very closer to $14 as another trend line support. You get to see that the 50 SMA is still under the stock, which is amazing. It shows a bullish sign and shows a strength, and the 200 SMA is below it. Although the RSI really hasn't been looking nicely for quite a bit. It obviously has been really close to the overbought situation since 30th of June. And then uh, just a little bit yesterday turned to neutral before it's to, uh, moving towards the jumping up so it still needs to confirm what the rsi is going to uh, take place in but it seems that there's a massive bullish view on this you get to see here around 1343 seems to be the support and as mentioned before the support sitting somewhere around 1338 followed by that 1262 uh and above that is 1379 in terms of the support so there's pretty good support going around here there's also another one but it's a weaker support since it's been in the after in the extended markets around 1408 Perfect. Uh, there's also been some news. Uh, well, first, I don't see any patterns here happening, but there's been some news about China having an increase in auto sales uh, recently. So in the EV sector, especially with the pollution in, uh, in the world and all that stuff, there's some uh, good news that is going to happen here, perhaps in terms of the next session for uh, deliveries for uh, vehicles. Uh, there's nothing new for my last uh, two DDs, especially the first one. But uh, let me know what you think about this stock in the comments below. Make sure you share, subscribe, and like, and have a wonderful day.